okay now see i'll tell you how we deal with happiness okay see this is the uh, this is one story i can tell you it may happen with you many times how our happiness dwindle if you you thought that uh, i would like to purchase a very beautiful shoe and uh, let's see whether the shoe is there on amazon you went to amazon you saw that there is a 79% discount is there on amazon you are very happy 79% discount boss this is the greatest immediately book it immediately you are happy right now when you browse you come to know the size of your food is 8 but 8 is not available gone the deal has gone oh there will be lot of anxiety my god the deal is going now let me check whether 8 is there in other shoe again your anxiety started you started searching it now after browsing lot you come to know yes blue is there eight is there eight number is there eight size is there and also it has 80% discount you are happy 80% discount boss this is very good that i left that 79% i get one more percent again you are happy you ordered it when you ordered you found that the shoe is arriving on particular day and from morning you have that anxiety when when the logistic executive will come and deliver me shoe at 2 o'clock there is a bell rang shoe arrived and you found some people who asked for money in your ganpati or durga they arrived they say we want chanda we want donation oh my god the whole happiness has gone again bell rang at 3 o'clock now it is amazon okay that person came and arrived and he has delivered a beautiful box to you you opened that box and you found very beautiful shoe very happy and you found that the shoe are little bit tight so it's a problem little bit tight you have sent this box return again you are unhappy they say let's let me return this box i don't want this box okay now again you are waiting for 7 days you got another box and you found this time it is very good it's it's proper okay and you tried it but you come to know that this is too loose even you tried with double socks or cotton socks you found that no 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 it cannot you returned it see the in whole transaction one transaction of purchase your happiness has changed at least eight times and that is not actually real happiness real happiness is that it is not connected to events it is not connected to purchase it is connected to your hormones it is connected to your state of mind that is a real happiness right so purchase has a utility value and not the happiness value if you understand this the purchase has a utility value and not the happiness value this value happiness value that you can get it from something else have you ever thought suppose there is a there is a thinking there is a thought generally generally 60 60000 thoughts in our mind and out of this 60000 thought only 60 to 70 thoughts they are of any use to us all other thoughts they are useless they make us happy unhappy 
and they then they wipe off every thought when it appears what you will have to do you will have to think whether this this particular thought is making me happy or unhappy to know this itself to know this itself will actually make you happy there is a important point of active acceptance what is that boss this is like this you have to accept it yes you have to accept it whether it is a appraisal whether it is a job whether it is a marriage whether it is your ambiance okay it's like this the the whole life will be like this i have to accept it and i have to go ahead when you get a satisfaction of actions remember when you get the satisfaction of actions and not of the zenith of your milestone you are done you are a happy person but if you bother about what is going to happen what is going to happen am i going to achieve it am i going to achieve it then is a problem if you think i'm not going to achieve it then that itself will cause a problem will will cause unhappiness you know you see animals you see dog unnecessary animals will be happy they will not have much unhappiness okay they will not have as a result of it digestion problem unhappiness will cause digestion problems if you actively accept something you are doing your own condition as a optimistic condition what is that consider consider that there is some theft surround your uh, they they in the ambiance you are in your society there is some theft now theft has made you very worried you are yes there, there is a theft is good that it has not happened to me yesterday i brought 1 kg of gold okay so <laughs> now you have to act over it now you can act this way that you can react first of all it should not happen second you can do that another reaction is that i will try to find out this thief what is in your hand to go to police report to police report to social media report to your friends report to society that is only in your hand you cannot go you cannot take out your sword and go and then you can say where is that thief okay i want to punish no you cannot what is there in your hand that is optimism so you have to do optimism because you have to you have to accept the reality what is that means the means that you are inside should be sorted this is like this this is like this i in my hand it is like this this much i can do okay i cannot make that particular horse to get it drink i cannot do i cannot uh, i cannot do the job of daroga and inspector and police police will do its job my in my hand this is what is there okay so even even during the events of life which are not in our hand and unnecessary if we take its responsibility and make it successful that leads to unhappiness right so accept the reality